Good evening and welcome to your News Now Sports. I'm Tony Quach. The UNOH softball team have won 12 games in the month of April. On Sunday, they play host to the Siena Heights Saints in doubleheader. The Lady Racers won game one, 9-1, so let's head to the second game. We start things off in the second. Anna Ankney rips this ball to deep center field. That bounces off the fence. Coming home and scoring is Zoe Johnson, and right behind her is Sydney Unger. She will be called safe due to the obstruction call. However, the sophomore was taken out of the game as the Lady Racers lead 2 to nothing. On the mound for UNOH is Shaylin Mullinex. She rings up two batters in the third and the fourth. She will allow no runs in seven innings with three total strikeouts. To the bottom fourth, Ankney is up once again, and she sends a hard grounder to the left field gap. Autumn Pelock rounds third, and she will score. Lady Racers take a three to nothing lead. And they keep adding more. Payne Albright ropes this ball to right field. It falls in for a base hit. Johnson will cruise on home with ease. UNOH wins this game five to nothing. Now we head up to Hancock County. The Lady Oilers take on the Walsh Lady Calves in the G-Max showdown. On the mound for Finley is the senior Emma Jones. In the first, Jones fans two batters for a 1-2-3 frame. And now in the bottom first, Alexis Antal drives this ball over the right field wall. Watch it fly and say goodbye. Finley takes a 1-0 lead on the solo home run. Then Jones goes back to work, and she puts up another zero in the second. She gets her girl looking at a call third strike, 11 total for her on the day. To the third, Carolina Turner sends a grounder past the second baseman. That brings home Annika Burdell. Home team leads two to nothing. In the third, Turner is up once again. Here's a ground ball too short. The throw to first gets by the fielder. Scoring is Addison Bender. Finley goes on to win six to four. 